We did what you asked. It's like I said. Fusar knows who you are and knows the price on your head. It's a big problem. Oh, I see. But if we can silence him, then I can help you escape before anyone has time to get here from America. That way, we all get what we want. We want to get the boat you promised us. And you will. But you have found yourself in the middle of a war, my friend. Fuso has called in the Navy from Cuba. There's no way a boat could leave right now. Hercule! Hercule, s'il vous plaît! Vite! Vite! Come. Follow me. So now we have a real problem. This must be the boat he called in from Cuba. That's a goddamn whoosh. You kinda have to hand it to this feller. So I guess great minds think alike. So what now? We fight or we won. Any of you boys feel like running? So what do we do? I will go get the cannon ready. Okay, let's get to it. <laughs> <laughs> So, what do we do? I say we push forward, because if we don't, we're going to die here and now. Okay, then. Follow me. This is kind of fun. Ah!
hit the old man! Very kind to you, Mr. Fusar! The old boat's coming, Bob. Damn it! What do we do now? I think I got a plan. You cover the left side. Okay. Must go and use the cannon. You go, Arthur. I'll gladly hold them off this beach a while longer. You sure? Just certain, son. Come on in. You think that cannon will be enough? Only one way to find out. Christ's sake, how many men has Fusar got? That's the problem. It doesn't matter how many we kill, he will have the money to get more. Watch out! Some more shot. Everybody water line. We need to put a serious hole in that boat. Let's get down from here. Come on. 
There was quite some shooting, boys. Thank you. What now? Oh, they'll be back. But I found a boat for you. And he should be arriving on the dock any time now. Great. Micah, go meet with the captain. If he's amenable and discreet, tell him we'll be ready to set sail soon. Bill, come help me collect poor old Javier. Sure. And cool. It was a great pleasure to make your acquaintance. I thought I was dead for sure. Hi, boys. We got a real problem. Nice Mr. Fusar don't want us going nowhere. He knows just who we are. If he can keep us here for a few more days, well... And what about the captain of the ship here? They got him trussed up like a hog. Guards all over the place. Got us surrounded with gun positions, so when we try to sail out, he's gonna blow holes in us. This fella is really beginning to try my patience. He ain't even had you tortured yet. <laughs> I like the man's style. He's thorough, nasty, and vindictive. However, in this instance, I don't see we got any alternative, but we go and free our friendly captain and destroy the artillery. For once, I agree with you. Very cool. Oh, I'll fight Alberto Fusa every day I can. All right. Bill, you're gonna guard Javier on the ship here. Micah, Arthur, let's get to work. They're cool. We follow you. Anale, this way. Artillery post. There's two guards. Arthur, come on. Get your knife ready. You take out the first guy, and I'll get the other one, okay? Damn it! Kill the bastard! Okay. We're clear. Let's plant the explosives. You got it secured properly, cowpoke? I think so. Knowing you, I have my doubts. Shut up, my kid. <laughs> Come on, run!
him. Oh, 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 I got you now, you bastard. We are all bastards, my friend. But only one of us is some would-be emperor's whore. We know who you are. And nobody knows who you are. Not even your goddamn father. You maggots are going to die. Eventually, I'm sure we will. But not today, and not because of you. The U.S. Navy is on the way. I am sure they are. Yeah. Which is why you're going to let us leave. Or you are dying right here, my friend. We've killed better men than you fools. Enough? Oh, I've had enough of this. Arthur? The rifle? Sure. Are you men gonna give up? Let us leave? Or are you gonna die? Put your guns down. I've had enough of this. Arthur? The rifle? Sure. Are you men gonna give up? Let us leave? Are you gonna die? Put your guns down. You saved my life. Thank you, Captain. I suppose you men are my cargo. Dutch Vanderlyn, I am sorry you got hurt. Uh, Captain Sam. Let's go. Gentlemen. Come on! What happened to Fusar? He escaped? I didn't see him! Damn it! Up there, I think. In the tower? Yes. Yes, that's him. This goddamn idiot. Come on! We have to take him down. The cannon up ahead on our left. Can you get to that? I'll try. Here. Captain, can you handle the ship? I'll be fine. Come on. 
We'll get going with the tide before I get any more surprise interviews with local officials. Are you gonna be okay? We'll be like you. We'll disappear probably. Back to IT. Believe me. We'll be long gone by morning. Good. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> we survived. Just about. What now? What now? What do you mean, what now? I mean, we're headed back to Lemoyne again, and we're all wanted men. <laughs> we slip ashore one by one, find out what's what. And we don't cut and run now? Head back to Blackwater. No. Why not? Because the last thing they'll be thinking is for us to turn up. We've been on the run for a while now, and it feels like, like our luck has turned. You know, I ain't turning back. We had a good run of it, I guess. We ain't even played our hand yet. We just need to put some more money in our pockets. Make our escape. Broke, alone, they're gonna pick us off one by one. And you know it. Maybe. Not. Maybe. We need to split up. Keep a low profile. Try to track down the rest. But carefully. See if they send any mail. Arthur, you check Shady Bell. We'll find each other eventually. We always do. And then what? Then we meet up. We gather the family, we get some money, and get the hell out of there. That's the plan. We all acting crazy. And that's not what I thought we were going to be doing here. We have here. been in a bad way. Listen. I will kill for my family. Any of you want to judge me for that? That's fine. But that is who I am. Anyone disagree? Anyone? <laughs>